Hi everyone, my name is Amanda Trott and I am a graduate student at NC State in the Biomathematics Department and I'm here to give a tutorial on how to install R. Now R is a statistical computing language and can be found on this web page www.r-project.org. Now the first thing you need to do to begin using this statistical software package is go to download packages and click the link that says C-R-A-N. Now Next, you want to choose a mirror. I always choose the one from Berlin, Germany, just because they usually have all the libraries I could possibly want. So that's the link I usually pick. You can pick any link you want. Now, you pick the download link here on this page for the operating system you have. I currently have Windows 8, so I would click Download R for Windows. Now, because you will be installing R for the first time, you want to click Install R for the first time. And then download R 3.0.1 for Windows. Now, as you can see, it downloads to the bottom of my screen. I'm, I'm currently in a Chrome browser, so R 3.0.1 is downloading. Now, I'm going to go back and we are going to look at what it looks like to download R for Mac. So you click on download R for Mac. The current R for Mac is 3.0.0 .0 called Masked Marvel and we go and click R-3.0.0 dot package to download the latest version of R for Mac. Now I'm not going to do that because I do not have a Mac, I have a Windows machine. But that would, that would be what you do and you follow similar instructions to downloading it for Windows. Now, for to use R, I use the program RStudio. RStudio is a graphical user interface for um, using R. Now, as you can see, our studio has its own screencast that you can watch and see how uh, one can use our our studio. But this is mine. Um, we're going to download. Click on this link. Download our studio. Now, if you run down R on your desktop, you click on the desktop link, which is what I will be doing for my Windows machine. Now, it automatically figures out what machine you have and recommends a particular RStudio for that machine. So I'm going to download that version of RStudio for my machine since I have a Windows machine. Now we just wait for everything to download. Now R has already downloaded so we're going to click on R and we hit OK for English and hit next and you probably want to read this license but it basically says that you will not um, violate their copyrights hit next and next I always install everything even though I have a 64-bit Windows and I'm going to accept the defaults. So setup will create an R folder in my start menu and a create a desktop icon and associate all R dot R data files with R. Now it's going to extract all the files for the setup and install R on my machine. And now you have installed R, so stay tuned for the next video for installation of R Studio.